everyone welcome to today's video thank you guys so much for being here today is mother's day and i just got back from taking my mom and one of my aunts out to dinner we had an amazing time and i just wanted to come on and say happy mother's day to all of you amazing mothers out there i hope you had an amazing day i hope you got to do something that you wanted to do whatever it was whether it be going to dinner shopping relaxing getting a massage just having some me time or quiet time anyway you guys deserve it you guys are amazing so happy happy mother's day again to all of the fabulous amazing mothers out there for today's video i have a sephora vib haul and i recently talked about just getting a few items on i don't remember what video it was but anyway i said i wasn't going to pick up a lot of things or i hadn't planned to and i just wanted to kind of pick up some staples and just get a few things um so we'll see how i did anyway i don't want this video to be too long so i'm just gonna kind of push through things so anyway i actually have let's see i got this bag obviously in store and i'm a vib rouge member so i got 20 percent off which is always a great thing and then I got this bigger box in the mail, another smaller box, and then one more smaller box. So I honestly cannot really remember the things that I got. So this shall be kind of interesting to me too. Anyway, uh, let's just start with the bags since I got this in store. Had no intentions of going into the store, but uh one of the things i needed to pick up was actually sold out online this was not a planned purchase because if you've seen my channel i have talked about this item before so i do already own it it is the super goop unseen sunscreen in the clear it has spf 40 it's basically a clear sunscreen which i absolutely love and the reason i purchased it is basically because my husband took mine he discovered it and then he stole it so it's basically a sunscreen it doesn't have um that large you know that sunscreen smell and it just goes on perfectly clear so it's great for all skin tones like it doesn't leave that white cast on your face and it's not greasy it's goes into your skin it doesn't clog your pores and i just really really have been loving this so anyway somebody stole mine so i had to go and get another one and it was sold out online next thing i got when i went in there was a clean uh fragrance and this is the box i believe this was like a hundred percent perk and this one is the clean reserve solar bloom i didn't even smell it but i don't know i always like to get perfume or fragrances so i don't know let's just see what it smells like it's like a little roller ball and i really love clean fragrances i've been wearing them for a long time and if you're a person that doesn't really like perfume or heavy fragrances definitely check out the clean fragrance line they have a lot of just natural light smelling more clean and fresh fragrances so they have um those type of fragrances absolutely love them one of my favorites so anyway this actually smells um really nice i actually really like that so uh will be great for the summer okay next uh i picked up a smaller size of the kat von d everlasting liquid lipstick and not a planned purchase this was in that little aisle that little checkout thing where you check out and it's just this nice reddish brownish color and kat von d liquid lipsticks are some of my favorite liquid lipsticks i absolutely love them they are very long lasting they don't really dry out my lips so that's the color and then what else did i get anything else in here 
So, I also picked up a, another fragrance. Um, this is Victor and Roth's Magic Liquid Diamonds. I actually gave my bigger bottle to someone else, so I just decided to get like this uh, roller ball. It's actually a spray though. And I love the smell of this. It's just nice and clean and fresh. So uh, check it out if you guys haven't checked it out. It is Victor and Ross Magic Liquid Diamonds. The same company that makes Flower Bomb. Uh, so the only other thing I have in here are just like a bunch of perfume samples. You guys know me. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> All right, that's it for the bag. Let's get into this bigger box. See what we have in here so first off i see that i have this and this is the glow pro micro needling regeneration facial tool and they do have this with other attachments like you can use on different parts of your body but anyway this is like the whole kit so it has the tool and then i also see that it also has like some creams and serums and I don't know so I'm really excited to check this out and then it also has a cleanser and it looks like it has something else in here I don't know but anyway it's basically a tool that you go over your face with it's supposed to create like little micro tears I know it sounds horrible but it's supposed to be really good for your skin and help your skin regenerate and allow your serums and creams to penetrate deeper and make you look more younger and youthful and glowing and all that other good stuff. So anyway, I'll have to let you guys know how it works or my thoughts on it after I use it for a while. But anyway, this was uh, pretty expensive, so I just decided to get it when it was 20% off. Next, I have something else that was that's pretty expensive. This is the Kiehl's Creme de Corpse lotion and I love this stuff so this is actually very expensive for a lotion and this is the 500 ml and I just decided to get it because it was 20% off and I love this lotion it's very moisturizing and hydrating but it's not greasy and that's what I really love about it so anyway uh, very expensive for lotion but great that I got it at 20% off Next in here are just some staples, things that I really love, which are the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, one of my favorite volumizing mascaras. Uh, love this stuff. Uh, I can't live without it. For some reason, I like the smaller like travel size better than the actual bigger tube, but um, I like to layer it over a lengthening mascara and then put this on and make your lashes look long and very volumous is that the right word anyway with a lot of volume next i got some clinique bottom lash mascaras and this is another item that i use all the time so it's just like a you know stocking up on everyday purchases this i've been using for a long long time it's just this mascara i've talked about this here on my channel before it has this little tiny brush and it is for your bottom lashes. So it coats all of the little tiny lashes on, you know, your bottom lashes. It even gets into the top corner of your upper lashes and those little lashes that are hard to get. So I absolutely love this mascara. I love the formula of it. It doesn't clump. It doesn't cake it doesn't flake off it doesn't smear and it's easy to take off so absolutely love 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 this mascara i will always repurchase it and i hope they never ever uh get rid of it or else i will kind of die <laughs> all right next thing i have is this and I talked about this here on my channel, like on my favorites video. So uh, this Laneige sleeping mask and I was running low. So I decided to pick this up just as a repurchase because I like to put this on my lips at night. 
and uh, that's what it looks like so just repurchasing that before I run out of it and I love that it has like this little tool that you can use so that you don't have to dig your fingers in there and get a bunch of germs in it so it does have like this little tool that you can use so that's that and then I picked up another lip product by Laneige this is the peach lip balm and I like that it we started making it in these tubes in different flavors this one is peach and you can carry this one in your purse so I don't have to you know carry around this big tube so excited to finally have this then I got this Murad moisturizer for my face this is something I use every day it is a moisturizer with a sunscreen and actually uh, this is not what I wanted uh, this is some type of murad acne control with salicylic acid in it uh, some kind of acne clarifying treatment um, anyway I just wanted my regular moisturizer uh, but anyway this is what I got not what I, I don't know if they sent me the wrong thing or I accidentally ordered the wrong thing uh, so I'll have to figure that out unless they changed it but no no this is not what I ordered so that's a fail definitely taking that back and what else is in here oh all right so I finally got this item so if you saw a video that I recently posted I don't remember which one it was but I talked about really wanting this palette it is the Huda Beauty new nude palette I've wanted this for a while but I resisted I don't need any more eyeshadow palettes one of my promises to myself is to not buy any more eyeshadow palettes because I don't need any more eyeshadow I have enough and I don't know I was just really good last year didn't really buy a lot of makeup and no eyeshadow palettes but this one has just been stalking me I've just been wanting it and I see everybody else with it so I just I don't know I just broke my promise uh, what can I say guys uh, just decided to pick it up and you guys are familiar with it by now but anyway it's just this beautiful rose gold type of pink palette and I don't know I love it so I don't know I just I just couldn't resist anymore I mean I don't know and it was 20% off so that's a plus all right um only other things in here are like samples um I got me an alien fragrance by Terry Mugley love this fragrance um yeah but anyway all right that's that box next box I have um Clarisonic brush replacement heads just a typical item that I you know just in my arsenal that I use every day just to uh you know replenish my stash you know at 20% off so anyway that's just always something that I use and then in here I have the makeup forever aqua XL eye pencil so this is actually just an eyeliner I'm not going to show it to you up close but anyway in the color black one of my favorites uh, this actually stays on forever and this is actually the second rendition of this or second line of this uh, they I loved 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 the original formula of it they kind of reformulated it I don't love this one as much as I love the original so I first heard about this I've been using it forever my makeup artist who did the makeup for my wedding told me about it and you know basically makeup forever like they started doing makeup I believe for the synchronized swimmers like makeup that wouldn't come off in water or sweat or exercise so this definitely stays put like even if you have watery eyes or I don't know it just doesn't smear because my eyeliner would always smear so I asked her about it and anyway this is what it was um, this one to me doesn't stay 
totally as put as the original formula but I do still have some of the original formulas but anyway this one's still good so I purchased that all right next I have in here are two things uh, these are Lolita it is the Kat Von D everlasting lip liner and lipstick liquid lipstick in the color Lolita I'm not going to open these just because they are a present for one of my co-workers at my previous location. She's like my makeup bestie and my planner bestie. So her birthday was actually in April and since I'm not there, I didn't get to get her a birthday present. But whenever they have the VIB sale, I always get her something, whatever, you know. She always tells me what she wants and then she just pays for it. I just use my discount. And anyway, she told me that she wanted these. So I'm just going to get her these as her birthday present. She doesn't know yet. So, you know, I'm just going to gift it to her. And at least I know that she really wants this item. So anyway, I also decided to get her this Violet Voss Berry Burst eyeshadow palette. And that's what it looks like. Just this pretty colors. I'm not going to open this either just because I don't want to ruin the packaging. And next, I got something for myself, which is just a love liquid not liquid but a love lip liner from Kat Von D it's just this nice purple color and now that I think about it I'm missing something <laughs> I think it was in the bag so it's just this nice pinkish purple color love it it's one of my favorite Kat Von D uh, colors anyway I believe I missed something let me go back to this bag did I? Yes, I did. I remember now. Uh, let's see. I got this lipstick. And these are actually like in, I saw them in that little thing where you check out, don't need any more lipstick. But anyway, they have these new lipsticks that are like from different places around the country so this one is the las vegas nevada one it's the color 51 and this one is actually a nice like bronzy color i thought it would be great for summer that's what it looks like really pretty so and these are not expensive they're only like i believe like eight seven or eight dollars or something like that so i didn't feel too guilty about that all right, the last item that I have, last box, here we go, is this. So let me take off the plastic here. Okay, so it is in this box. Yes, I had to get like a fragrance a bottle <laughs> just one believe it or not and this is Mon Guerlain from the house of Guerlain and I've just had samples of this so I saw it online I just decided to get it and I love the house of Guerlain they have amazing fragrances they are an old one of the oldest fragrance houses and they just have a huge arsenal of fragrances so anyway decided to pick this one up i have never actually seen it in a sephora store but uh that's what the bottle looks like it's just a nice pretty fragrance it's one of their newer fragrances i think i want to say it was launched in maybe last year and now they do have other flankers of it like I think a rose and a floral one and something else. But anyway, this is like the original one, Mon Guerlain. Mon Guerlain. I don't know. I like to say that word for some reason, Mon Guerlain. But anyway, um, it's just a nice, pretty fragrance. Uh, let's spray it. So anyway, it has like hints of lavender. Not a whole bunch, but when it dries down, it's just really soft and pretty. So it has lavender, jasmine, vanilla, something else. Anyway, those are the notes that I remember. But anyway, if you guys have this, let me know what you guys think. Or if you smelled it, let me know what you guys think. 
like I said, I've never seen it at an actual Sephora store. I just saw it online. So they do have it at places where they sell Guerlain fragrances like Saks or Neiman Marcus. So if you want to smell it, definitely check it out. Maybe at one of those places. And last but not least, I have here in this box something that I have no idea what it is. Um, yeah, <laughs> this is it. It says on it, Diamond Buff by B Stunning. I don't even remember what this is. That's so sad. Okay, so anyway, I guess I'm just going to have to open it to find out what it is. I really honestly have no idea. Um, oh, <laughs> now I remember what this is. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Let me take it out for you guys. So basically what this is, is a micro dermabrasion tool. And you're supposed to be able to use it on your skin wet or dry. So say if you want to use it wet, you just kind of moisten your skin or moisten the tool. And then you just go over your face, like sweep it on your face and it removes the dead skin cells, you know. So it's it's pretty gentle like I mean it has enough of a texture on it to remove dead skin cells but you know doesn't seem like it's too harsh um, I wanted this just because it's supposed to you know remove those pesky dead skin cells and remove all the nice soft glowing skin and allow your skin to absorb creams and serums better and you know you have that nice glowing fresh fabulous skin that's underneath and I like that it's more portable and you know you can just put it in like if you're traveling just put it in your bag and you know uh, very portable so anyway it wasn't that expensive I don't remember how much it was but it really it might have been like 20 or 30 or 35 dollars I don't know anyway it wasn't that expensive but I got 20% off and it did have good reviews so I'll have to use it and let you guys know you know my thoughts on it or how it works out anyway guys that's it thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch this video I really appreciate it sorry I just kind of rushed through everything but I didn't want the video to be too long I didn't even introduce myself I don't think anyway if you're new to my channel my name is Lisa welcome to my channel thank you guys so much for being here if you haven't subscribed to my channel I would really love for you to subscribe and definitely become part of my little family here and click the little notification bell below so you'll be notified each time I upload a video thanks again guys for watching have an amazing week and I'll see you guys next time bye